Hey everybody, welcome to Let's Game It Out. We're playing Another World. Another World. Another World. So, Josh, to be clear, not, not the, wait, not this, not, not this. Not this world, oh, not this world. Uh, um, right. Another World. What? One that is unlike ours in many respects, except this one apparently still has gingers for some reason, so. I know. We'll <laughs> We've both played this game probably many, many times. As you can see, this is the 20th anniversary edition. Came out a while ago. Uh, all right, let me get this underway here. Ready to go, Anthony? I'm in it to win it. I do... I do... I'm not gonna lie to you. I think more fondly of this game than I do of actually playing it again, because I recently played it again, but I'm happy to watch. Cool. Yeah, I'm... I'm, uh... I'm running this one. And, uh, yeah, this game came out in 1991, and I remember that these graphics were pretty breathtaking back then. Heck yeah, man. Not so much today. Although, what we're looking at right now is the enhanced graphics that they... they sort of redid for this version, I gather. And you were, um... You said you played this on the PC more than anything else? I did. I bought it when it came out in... 91? <laughs> 1991? Yeah. I think... I played this on the Genesis. I think most people did play this game on the Super Nintendo or Genesis. And my understanding was the Genesis was the better one to play it on, because Super Nintendo is very, very, like, it experiences a lot of slowdown. Four, five, one, one, nine, three, two. I don't know why I'm remembering this. We're not going to need to know it. That's that's Josh's pin code for his ATM card. Shit. So if you, if you see Josh, free money. Yeah, punch me in the face, take my wallet. And everything is yours. I believe that's how that works. Oh, yeah. Bing, bong, bong. I see you have driven here in your Ferrari. Welcome to the Pleasure Dome. I love, like, they show the key. I always thought it was so funny. Like, why are they showing? Yep, I used the key to get into my fer Ferrari. <laughs> this is how programming is, right? You open up your Jello cube, and you're like, all right, DOS. And, and yeah, Run Project 23 is the only way I start coding. Um, so, yes, this is highly <laughs> accurate. <laughs> Oh, yeah. Oh, uh, see, so, yep, off G minus. That's the smart thing. Yep, shield off. Shield off, yeah, of course, because we're not we're not boys, we're men. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, so now that we've built this uh, particle accelerator, I believe. <laughs> something that was actually pretty cool about this game, I remember it being like, I mean, this style of doing graphics was not something you saw at this time. And uh, this kind of cinematic, st like this right here with the can popping, felt like... Like uh, like you're watching a movie, and that was something you just didn't see. Yep, it was you know polygonal graphics uh, ish. Uh, you know, the yeah exactly like there was like some some movie stuff put into this. Ooh, smash cut! Like for example, the smash cut to the thunderstorm, which can only make things go awry. Yeah. Oh yeah. This is Mother Nature. By the way, what shit-ass facility do you work in if your particle accelerator can't handle a little lightning strikes, know what I mean? Oh, yeah. Well, I'm sure this is a uh, an ill-gotten, created project kind of thing. Oh, yeah. Oh, oh sh uh, shit balls. Careful, the particle accelerator is being chased by some- Whoa! Oh, hey, oh, wow! I love this part right here. Well, and that's the end of that guy. By the way, that enhanced graphics is nice. This is my favorite part it right is. here. Oh, Kaboom. now I'm controlling. I'm stuck in the hut. Huh. Yeah, you right, are. Let's go. Swim, motherfucker. Let's get out of here. Don't let the tentacles catch you. <laughs> mm. Oh, there's that beast up there. Whew. All right. We're okay. So we play as a dude here named Lester who wears some sweet-ass cargo pants. Oh, ah, see, Josh. Sorry. Sorry. There's no rest for the weary, that and Lester can't be a goddamn nerd about this. We gotta... <laughs> This is, we're out of this world, or, or whatever we're this, we're in another world. Yeah, in America this was called, alright, I uh, got the control, so we can kick, we can duck and kick, we can jump. Nice. Uh, that's about all this uh, nerd's capable of. I love his little casual kick, like, eh, me, eh, 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 eh. Sweep the leg. I drive a Ferrari. <laughs> <laughs> and uh, these guys that I'm kicking right now are little slugs that, uh, huh. <gasps> it's it's my khakis. Just a little nick in the knee, oomp. <laughs> yeah, take that, you Biped bitch. And this is one of those games where it uh, makes you redo a bunch of sequences. So we're gonna now that now that we've we have a, a sense of these things, we're just gonna get through this quick. Man, Josh, you're like playing it? ballsy. Oh uh, shit. Um. Uh. Run. You, you're cool. Oh. <laughs> Ooh, I, I love was that. surprised that he stood there for a second. I thought that. Uh, 
thought he would tackle me immediately. Man, I, for those watching, I mean, if you've never played this game before, I don't think you can respect how YOLO Josh is playing with those <laughs> slugs right now because those things, like just one pixel off and you're fucked. Oh, back the other way, bro. Nah, I got this. They actually made the sequence easier in this version. Before, uh, he goes a little faster and if you don't run jump, you... Oh, oh yeah. Thought that might have been the end. It's like the Jawas all got big, and that's the, <laughs> that's like the me, the Ur Jawa. Yeah, it's like Shack Shack Jawa. He's like, hey, I'm a Ferrari owner. Are you a Ferrari owner? <laughs> Are I'm you really rich oh. in my? Oh. oh, I see. You drive a Corvette. This is this is uh, this is awkward. <laughs> yeah, you're one of those Corvette dicks. <laughs> Wasn't that kind of like the urban legend where it was like anyone who drove a Corvette was just like automatically categorized as an asshole. I mean, I feel like I'm not saying I thought this. Did I? I don't know. Are you just jealous that you don't have a Corvette? Absolutely. <laughs> <laughs> All right, so we kind of glossed over that, but now we're inside this cell with the Stay Puff Marshmallow Man or whatever this is. Uh, but that's like Sloth from the Goonies yeah. in his like clubbing <laughs> outfit. <laughs> but uh <laughs> I'm swinging the cage, Anthony. I know you are, and you're doing great too. I've been clubbing enough to know. Yeah, this is what you're supposed to do. This is how you. This is how everything starts. The power exchange. Hey, chill out, dude. Don't shoot that at me. Something bad might happen to you. Ugh. And I don't know if that was like a voice synth or if that was just. Uh, I love that. Yeah. What do, what do you uh, think like, he says oh, there? Yeah. Uh, he's like, "Come, little Ferrari owner." Yeah. <laughs> Ferrari. That's all he says. Ferrari. Yeah. Ferrari. Oh! Yeah! It's what he gets. I still love that sound effect in animation. That's so good. Yeah, so when you kill people, as you can see, they just sort of cartoonishly just turn into like a f Oop, I shot him. The guy off screen, I shot him because you can see his ashes over in the, yeah, in the corner. Yeah, he deserved it, Josh. He got what's coming to him. But yeah, we're doing this a little bit fast. Hey, Sloth, hurry up. But uh, yeah, this, he's opening the keypad or trying to hack it. I'm using my gun, which can make shields, as you can see. Ooh. Bye, dude. Yeah. Dale, no, really, Whoa. take your time, Marshmallow. <laughs> Where are you going, no, Josh? I you left I, your I thought he was on there. <sighs> man. Sorry, man. Not everyone's as fast Let's as... Let's go up here first. Oh, yeah. Hey. Oh, yeah, look through the window. Look the window. Let's see what's through here. Oh. And so the desolate other world revealed itself. The other world of just dildo castles. Yeah. And not one Ferrari dildo <laughs> castle in sight. <laughs> Which is most upsetting. Yeah. I see. So, if I recall, we need to go all the way down to the basement together and uh, take care of something here. Surprise! Uh. And now I, I shot a little thing on there that was uh, giving power to something, I think. It's my recollection, anyway. Let's head back up here. And let's see what's up. Yep. Okay, so I, I killed the power on these. And I blew it open with my gun. And, uh, there we go. Go down this elevator. See, now that guy's trying to blow his way out, which we are not interested in that. I love that. There is so much good stuff in this game, isn't there? I There's some cool uh, sounds. I, I mean, uh, and a lot of things, too. Oh, that guy's coming in. <gasps> Quick! Thanks. <sighs> dun, 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 dun. You think he's gonna be okay? I don't know. This doesn't look... Do you think they're gonna be okay? You just hear this... Yeah, yeah, just this, like, weirdly loud, like... <sighs> Yeah, exactly. Welcome to the power exchange. <laughs> May I enter your sphere? I don't know what that means, but I guess. Um, all right, let's, uh... Oh. <laughs> Not the right way. That's what happens when Josh doesn't pay attention. I'm sorry. Ooh, okay. Oh, steam. Ooh, what a way to go. I know. That you, you mean in, like, just sudden, immediate pain? Well, look how claustrophobic it is, and then steam is what killed you. That shit had to be so hot that it, like, vaporized your skull. Oh, yeah, and no one's coming something. to find my body. I mean, I'm yeah. already in... <sighs> Son of a bitch. God I'm already in it. another world. Another world. But, uh, yeah, no one's crawling through these to find some human corpse. Uh, so, the guy who made this, Eric Chahi, I think is how you pronounce his name, um... He gave a talk at GDC about it, I think, oh, game, which game, GDC is the Game Developers Conference, and I think he talked about what, Son of oh, a bitch. <laughs> he talked about these sweet steam spigots he put in here <laughs> just to fuck with us, um, but at the Game Developers Conference, which is, you know, for those who don't know, it's like, it's the biggest uh, conference in the world for uh, people who make games, like that's kind of like their big, the biggest annual, most important kind of conference. 
And so you get heavy hitters like him, uh, who he gave a talk about its development and whatnot. It was cool. I, I, I didn't go to the talk, but uh, a couple of my buddies were talking about it. And like, you know, he talks about, you can see the oh, a <laughs> pool of blood. <laughs> uh, yeah, that blood comes out rather fast, doesn't it? Well, hey, you know what? It would in real life, right? Just and just oh, oh now Josh. I'm just getting impatient. I'm sorry, Eager Beaver baby. <laughs> but that's a dude, and oh, you know, fuck. Oh. <laughs> I, uh, I mean, I'm giving Josh a, a very, very, very small amount of shit about this because this is what this game is all about. It is tough. <laughs> it is a puzzle solver, and like you think you were in the exact same spot, and you decide to rush it, and oops, you rush too much. You know, it just it's uh it's awesome. Though. I'm sweating over here. Good, good, good move on waiting. Yeah, I would have done the same thing. Thanks, man. But please continue uh, the talk by the creator of this game. Yeah, and so from what I understand, like he um, he he made a bunch of money, if I remember, on a previous game he made. Um, uh, I, I could look it up, um, but I think he and ah. like uh, he made made some money on another game, which kind of gave him the freedom to do his own thing. I love that recharge stage. Yeah, recharge my gun just there. Yeah, and and it's funny. So, and I don't know, like so. Um, Eric Chahi is, uh, if I, I'm sorry if I'm not pronouncing his name right, but um, he's uh, he's French. And so I feel, and I could be wrong, but I feel there's a lot of like French design aesthetic in this game, or aesthetic, I should say, in this game. Um, ooh, nice. But he was saying a lot of his influences were Dune. Like, look at this, foreground action. You didn't see that in games at the time, you know? Oh, <laughs> oh you did that on purpose, but that was worth it. I actually, so that was semi on purpose. I thought I hit the jump button at the last minute. I didn't. <laughs> I, d I didn't. Oh no, we we saw. Uh, oh, do you want to try and? Uh, that's so good. Do you want to try and uh, jump over yonder pass? Uh, maybe next time. Yeah. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you.